Hey, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praises to the Most High Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Waharuka Kadash. Yahweh is the true name of the Most High Power, the Most High God of Israel. Yahweh Shai is the true name of His only begotten Son, the one whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus, Yeshua, Jehovah, Christ, and other names. Ruka Kodash is the Holy Spirit that gives us the understanding of this truth. I want to send my double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone GMS who taught me this truth, which has done represent truth. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect spread around four corners of the earth, pushing this gospel in all sincerity. Shalawam also to the few aquats who are sincerely seeking this truth. It's the brother Yarayaya Shar Allah from the GMS Italy camp. And I just really want to do this quick lesson. Hopefully, it's going to be edifying to the spirit. So, this is an article on the news. You know, every every time they celebrate this Saturnalia, in which Saturnalia is another way of calling Christmas, you know, which has nothing to do with our Savior, Yahweh Shai. You can watch the last video I did and, you know, the other apostle Taha went in on the lesson. Also, the other apostle Aramlab, they both went in, you know, and they did, you know, elaborated lessons, you know, showing you the history of, you know, this celebration that they're celebrating right now, which has nothing to do with our Savior. Our Savior was born at the time of, um, of Passover, you know, he was born at the time of Passover and he was also killed at the time of Passover, you know. So, anyway, this is um, Pope Francis. The Christmas message ought to be a ought, ought to be a ought to be finding solution to overcome the sea, Vanessa for the poor, you know. So he said the pontiff spoke of the demic violence against women and wars only dialogue can lead to the resolution of conflicts so as you all know as you should know now those who are in this truth you know those who've been listening for some time you know you should know that um this pope right here the entire the entire um catholic the entire papacy has nothing to do with the truth it is actually the false um, prophet that's spoken of in, in Revelation, I think that's um, 16, 13, in which we're going to get some of those scriptures right now, you know, but just wanted to read quickly. It says, in this Christmas message, Orbi El Orbi, in which I try to look up the meaning of this Orbi, it says, Chitape. Antonomasia in Omaja I record the classic La Città di Roma. So it actually speaks about the city of Rome. Okay. Then Orbi. Acecare. It means to blind. You know. To bereave. You know. Which I really don't know what's the meaning of bereave. I'm going to look it up. But Acecare means to blind. You know. Let's check this thing out. Bereave. 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 Hope I'm spelling it well. Bereave meaning. It says, wow. It says, be deprived of a close relation or friend through their death. She had recently been bereaved wow so if you put both together it gives you where is it it says um the roman bereave wow wow we'll just leave that there like that you know it says in the christmas message orbi a orbi a means and and that's um french i believe it says from the central loggia of San Pietro, Pope Francis prayed to God to grant health to the sick and inspire all people of goodwill to find the most suitable solution to overcome the health crisis and its consequences. 
and we know his prayer is not to the to the to the real God of the Bible. His prayer is to is to the God of this world, you know, Satan, you know. So this man right here is actually doing the full will of those who have kept him in position, which is nothing but a puppet, and he is a voice for for the new world new world order, you know. So he's the one that is you know leading this um is jakes that are blind in these religions you know is the head of let's say the 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 world churches that you have in in the world you know the, the papacy is the head of the churches you know so we that we are actually not members of any churches you know that we are actually a hebrew israelites you know we follow the truth of the bible we know ourselves we are the stones of that 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 that, that built the the churches you know our bodies are uh are the temple of the most high yahweh shem Shai. so we're not part of those churches you know and what you should know is um certain groups of the hebrew israelites you know they're nothing but you know churches just like churches you know nothing changes you know they're just using the hebrew israelite thing to be disguised you know um, groups like the high UIC, ISUPK, HOI, and many others, you know. So it says, and I'm not saying this to to throw shots or whatever. I'm just you know trying to be, trying to be sincere as possible as I as I can, you know, because the scriptures, the book of Ezekiel, we we warned, you know, to lift up our voice and you know tell the truth, you know, just roughly paraphrasing, you know tell the truth to to the to, to the house of israel you know so their blood wouldn't be on our hands you know so i'm speaking out this truth you know to get rid of the blood from my hands it says the pontiff then launched an appeal to get the necessary treatments especially vanessa to the populations most in need so you see <laughs> and you know the scriptures don't really tell us to do any of those things you know we are also one in the book of leviticus if it's if i'm not mistaken 28 you know not to make any cuttings into our flesh you know so he says prayer for women children and elderly it says son of god comfort the victims of violence against women that is rampant in the time of emek pope francis invoked in his christmas message which was attended by about 20,000 faithful in Piazza San Pietro. Damn, man. So you had like 20,000 people leaving their homes, you know, to, to go stand in that Piazza San Pietro to listen to this band, you know, do all those enchantments. Well, many are called, few are chosen. So he says, you know, when we know they're not calling on the Son of God, they're actually calling on the Son God, the Sole Invictus. You know so what they're trying to put out you know violence against women violence against women and all these things you know you know it says offer hope to children and adolescents who are bullied and abused and what they're trying to do here you know i mean trying to put these women on pedal stones you know trying to break up families you know this feminism thing you know these are the people actually pushing it you know on the spiritual level you know the Most High has an hierarchy in which he has created us. The woman is supposed to be under the man, you know. But, you know, this kingdom, just like I was watching a lesson that, you know, the other apostle Ramlab did, you know. They've actually put these women on a pedal stone and, you know, they've given them the positions of men, you know. So when you do things like that, it's definitely that you have all different kinds of um, problems coming up, you know. They even have um, these women, you know, competing with actual men who, who, who went through the transformation. You know, let's just put it like that. You know, <laughs> they get him beaten by these men, you know. <laughs> so, you know, there is there is a lot of confusion, you know, and that's what Babylon is all about. Babylon means confusion, you know. And here it says, Hover, offer hope to the children and adolescents who are bullied and abused. He added, offer consolation and affection to the elderly, especially those who are most alone. Give serenity and unity to families, the primary place of education and the basis of social fabrics. You see, 
I'm going to speak about the children aspect, but you know, before I speak about the children aspect, you know, this is not this is not a prayer, you know. Yahweh Shai taught us how to pray, you know, and it sounds nothing like this. He's not he's not praying for the kingdom of heaven to come, you know. He's not he's not doing all that, you know. He's not praying for the will of the most high Yahweh Shemi Al Shai to be done on earth as it is in heaven, you know. These people are not actually looking up to, to the kingdom to come, you know. So people that are actually following them, they are nothing but zombies, you know. They don't, they don't have sense to think on their own. They don't, they don't put one plus two together, you know. One plus two gives them seven and they're okay with it, you know. They don't question, they don't, they don't, they don't make any researches, you know. So the Most High has actually given them in the hands of this, you know, blind and demonic leaders, you know, devilish and wicked people who are going to actually lead them to destruction, you know. And speaking of the children, he is not praying for the children that are being eaten, that their blood is being collected for adrenochrome in which he is guilty of such. He is part of that, you know, we've, he's been convicted many times, you know, but, you know, being the powers that be, they bury all these things up, you know, the Epstein case, the, the Max, Maxwell Gislaine case, you know, they bury all these things up. He would never speak about it. He would never speak about the children that have been, you know, um, that have been um, kidnapped from all different parts of the world. Their organs have been harvested, you know, they've been eaten up like nothing, you know. Their blood has been, adre um, has been harvested for, for adrenochrome, you know. That's how you know all these devils are actually part of, they're part of, you know, the NWO, you know. All they do, you see, check this out. That's him, you know, kissing the image. They, they, that's baby Baphomet, actually, you know. So, you see, these people, <laughs> check this out, man. <laughs> check this out. And this is a rite that they do, you know, in the land of the Amalekites right there. And the Amalekites, you know, occupy in Israel now, you know, they circumcise babies and they suck the blood out of the baby's um, penis, you know, with their mouth. These people are about to be judged, man. This place is true. Check out the Dagon art. That's the art of Dagon, you know. That's the fish god. It has nothing to do and check all this out the gold and everything you know check so where is it written in the bible that we should have all these idols you know these people have more idols than sh than a shaman you know they're actually shamans you know so anyway let's go pick out some scriptures you know i was saying about this false prophet so False prophet. So this is the book of Revelation 16, 13. It said, And I saw three unclean, unclean spirits like frogs come out of the mouth of the dragon and out of the mouth of the beast and out of the mouth of the false prophets. You know, in which the dragon represents Esau the beast represents the system, you know, and the false prophet represents the Vatican, the Pope, you know. So, those frogs and unclean spirits are actually, you know, part of their laws and their, uh, and their own unrighteous um, decrees, you know. How they turn things upside down, you know, you're turning off things, you know. Let's see if I can get that scripture. Turning of things, turning. See, seems like it's in the book of um, Isaiah. Let's 
Oh. Excuse me, I hate it when I look for a scripture because I didn't actually prepare anything for them just going through the spirit. You know. Let me get it through this way. Khan, Isaiah 29, 16. You know, I had a feeling it was in the book of Isaiah, Isaiah 29, 15. 29, 15. Is it? 16, Khan. So he says... I'll start from verse 15. It says, Woe to those who seek deep to hide their counsel far from the Lord, Yahweh Shemel Shai, and their walks are in the dark. They say, Who sees us and who knows us? They mind you, under the Vatican, they said that there is, um, I don't know how many, I can't remember, I used to know that that info. You know, there is a, a mass amount of, you know, kilometers under the, under the Vatican, you know, in which they have lots of documents buried under that place you know hidden from everyone you know in which some of those documents could just you know blow your mind up and let you know the true the truth about the true israelites you know because these people they 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 they, they actually went all around the world you know picking up all different documents and stealing and killing you know this pope actually the, the papacy is their is their spiritual headquarter you know that's their priest you know so he says surely you have you have turned no you have you have things turned around shall the potter be esteemed as the clay now this is not the scripture that i'm looking for he said for your turning of things could it be Let's keep reading. Anyway, that's good. That's also good. You know, it says, Surely you have things turned around. You know, shall the potter be esteemed as the clay? For shall the thing made say unto him that made it, it did not make me? Or shall the thing formed say of him who formed it, he has no understanding? You know that's what those people do they turn things all around all their wickedness that they put around you know these wicked laws and wicked decrees you know that's the the unclean spirits like frogs you know verse 9 chapter 19 20 says and the beast was taken with him the false prophet you know which is the beast represents the system the false prophets the the vatican the, the pope you know and you know it's not only the pope you know it's actually incorporated with all the churches you know as i explained earlier you know that wrought miracles before him with which it deceived them that had received the motb you see and them that worshipped his image these boats were cast alive into a lake of fire burning with brime stones you know in which you know this tells you that you know the vatican city is also going to be destroyed you know and a huge part of rome is going to be destroyed if not you know the majority of italy itself you know because you know the false prophets and the beast they were all both casted into the into the fire man that's the the the, the nuclear bombs are going to reach those places you know so we pray the most high how Shai is also going to protect us you know he's going to be merciful unto us you know is going to see us through. We're going to be counted amongst his elect. You know, Yehovah Hashem Yahushai Rataza. This is what we pray every day. You know. So anyway, I just wanted to bring out this short lesson. Hopefully, it was edifying. You know, I'd like to give all praises to the Most High. Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai Baharukakudash Shalom.